Hello, everybody. Welcome to London and welcome to PCR Val's eCourse 2020. My name is Bernard Prendergast, and on behalf of the course directors, Francesco and Andreas with me here in London, and Nico and Corrado, who sadly can't be with us, I'm very pleased to welcome you and to thank you for joining us for the world's largest course dedicated to the field of heart valve disease. A course that addresses the needs of three communities, surgeons, interventional cardiologists, and imaging specialists, focusing on three valves, aortic, mitral, and tricuspid, in three days. A course that will be broadcast live from three studios in London, Paris, and Toulouse, that will encompass the PCR family of three valve meetings in London, Tokyo, and Chengdu, China, and that will embrace the growing collaboration, the educational collaboration that we enjoy with CRF, as demonstrated by our planned workshop in Latin America, and our successful collaborations at TCT and TVT this year. A truly global endeavor. And indeed, Andreas, in 2020, valvular heart disease remains a major global healthcare burden. I think it's fair to say you, you cannot overstate the relevance of valvular heart disease for cardiology and interventional cardiology. The global map here on this slide of valve intervention shows two things. One, a steep increase in procedures done. At the end of 2020, we will have done more than 150,000 TAVIs, more than 25,000 mitral interventions. And now, tricuspid intervention becomes a clinical reality. This global map shows another thing as well. Uh, there is still a geographical variation and there are inequalities in access. So there's work to do to make uh, these treatments available to all our patients worldwide. Now, 2020 is also the year of the pandemic and COVID did change our lives. It did change our practice. Just one slide showing that interestingly, in the UK, these are NICOR data, our national registry, TAVI was the one procedure of all the cardiovascular procedures in the cath lab and in the operating theaters that showed the least reductions. Why is that? Just a thought. Because A, TAVI is a life-saving procedure, you cannot put it off, and B, it can be delivered quickly and safely other than heart surgery. The pandemic changed everything. The pandemic also changed how we do education. At this point, a thanks to the core team and all the big team that was involved in creating this program. We set out to do something new and create a format that looks to maximize the learning effect and minimize the risk for patients, operators, panelists, and you, the audience. I think we've created a comprehensive course, three days, three valves, and at the heart, it's the, at the core, it's the heart team. So it's a new format, but it's in the spirit of the good old PCR London valves. Thanks, Andreas. And of course, Francesco, it's only one year ago that we were here together in London celebrating the merger of PCR London valves with the Zurich MVM course. What have you brought with us, or what have you brought with you to London this week? So, Bernard, this is the original bag uh, for the Mitervald meeting. It's a bag full of good memories. Uh, this was a course for everybody, for the heart team. It was a course which was open to surgeons, interventionists, imagers, nurses, all allied professionals. The same applies for the spirit here uh, in these three days three days which are dedicated to all of us, all of us who have uh, interest in this field. And inside of the bag, yeah, in the bag, in the bag, above all, I have this book, which I just bought at the airport in Zurich, coming here. And I think this, I hope this will inspire all, uh, all uh, us 
in these few days, brief answers, I would say also smart and sharp answers to the big questions. Because in these three days, we will uh, have the opportunity of uh, discussing multiple topics which are relevant to our practice in a comprehensive program with uh, live presentations, live discussions, virtual live demonstration of uh, interventions. We will have a live presentation of late-breaking trials and also important spotlight sessions live, which will uh, make uh, the state of the art on, uh, on the three valves. But we have also more than live because we produce a number of uh, important educational opportunities and learning opportunities in collaboration with TCT uh, in, with a focus on multimodality imaging of all three valves. We delivered, as usual, uh, as uh, I would say traditional for uh, uh, PCR events, step-by-step uh, -step, uh, learning the fundamentals events. And we also kept the idea of classroom-style workshops with simulation-based learning. But above all, there is your contribution. There is you. You come here. I see you through the camera. You are there listening to us. We want to be together because you will be uh, part of the program with your abstracts, your case submissions. We selected the best cases, the best innovation, the best ideas, the best of the best. And returning to the global theme, we are joined live by active participants in 12 city pods spread across the globe over five continents who will be joining us throughout, but also participating live in the Q&A sessions in conjunction with the spotlight and the live case demonstrations. We enjoy and look forward to uh, experiencing their interaction and their comments from a regional and international perspective. So let's now turn to Paris and let's reach out to Nicole and Antoinette and please tell us a little bit more in depth about the program and the platform. Hello Bernard, good morning everyone and thank you for joining. I'm in the studio in Paris with Aunt Antoinette and uh, together we are going to show you a little bit how the platform functions. But before we start I would like to give you two important messages. The first one is that in case you missed a session or you have a conflict in your agenda, then no worries because the sessions will be available the next day and they will remain available for a month till the 24th of December. So don't worry, you can still attend, attend your favorite sessions. The second point is that interaction is very important in this meeting and we really hope to hear from you. So we have the chat box and we had ch chat masters who are moderating those chat boxes. So you can use them either to discuss together or to ask questions. So please feel free to join and interact. So now let's move to the platform. Here we are in the lobby and we can decide what to do next. If you want to attend the session, go to the exhibitions and here Antoinette will tell us more. Okay, so let's have a look at some of the channels. We have the main arena channel, and here we have our live, virtual live case demonstrations, our late breaking trials, and we can interact worldwide with our city pods. We have the simulation based learning channel, and we can tune in to episodes on anatomy and imaging. We have learning the fundamentals channel. So that's three days where we'll have uh, three frameworks for procedures, procedural based frameworks. There is, of course, Cases and Abstracts Corner and uh, Expert Interviews Corner, which is a wealth of topics that we can access. So uh, we have, of course, a virtual exhibition hall. Um, this time we're going to have to make our own coffees, but we can still interact with our industry partners. It's a great opportunity for networking. And of course, you can redeem your PCR um, uh, at the booth as well, and you can access your copy of a special Valves edition of Euro Intervention. There's the ever popular Training Village, and this year we have real-time virtual workshops uh, so space is limited, so sign up in advance if there's something that interests you because uh, once the places are taken, it's full. 
And of course, we have to thank you for all your submissions. We have over 250 submissions with 140 presentations that are recorded. So here you can access the cases, you can access the posters and the abstracts. And we encourage you to see the wealth of knowledge and the wealth of work that's going to be presented. So it's three days. It's a, it's a big program, Nicole. We're very excited. Absolutely. We're talking about three life centers. We're talking about 13 late break tri breaking trials and 300 faculty. And the cherry on the top, we have nine CME credits that can be provided if you attend. Each hour will we'll make a one CME credit. So it's a winner, winner, dear. Absolutely. <laughs> so now I'll hand it to Toulouse. Hello, Jean. Hello, Didier. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. And um, what you could see on this slide is uh, really important. Life does not get better by chance. It gets better by change. And it's true that 2020 is really, for education, the, the year of changing. Life changes. PCR is changing. And we move to 100% digital. <coughs> Everything is totally different. And you could see the, on this slide <coughs> the view of the main arena. View of the main arena, sorry, <coughs> view of the main arena. And uh, all those of you who experienced uh, the previous meeting, PCR meeting, understood what does the special relationship within this uh, arena, within this uh, uh, training village, learning rooms, exhibits, where you can meet uh, friends, meet uh, industry people. And now we move to the digital world. We move from room to channels. So everything is changing, but the fundamentals are exactly the same. And this is very important. In other words, we maintain this fundamental, and this is our mission of PCR. In other words, is to serve the needs of each individual patient by helping the cardiovascular community to share knowledge, experience, and practice. And the fundamental goal of learning for healthcare professionals is to deliver the most appropriate and economical suitable management for each patient, considering their particularities and in the light of experience, evidence, and constraint. So, Didier, I would like to give you the microphone now, but uh, first I would like to thank you, and I take this opportunity to thank you for what we have achieved in Clinique Pasteur. It's a tremendous achievement uh, with uh, fantastic work in the last uh, five to 10 years. And uh, what you have achieved with uh, today with Nicolas Dumonte is really impressive. So thank you for what you did for our hospital. Well, thank you very much, Jean. It's, uh, it was a, it's a real privilege and honor to uh, collaborate with you. And so, uh, just a word on uh, social media, as you can see, you can use the hashtag PCRVALS just to connect with us. We have a dedicated social media team. You can join them, whether it be on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, or LinkedIn. We need your input because these social media are a great way to connect with colleagues worldwide and to share content. So importantly, what we want uh, to get from you are photos, for example, of uh, how you attend that meeting because we need positive vibrations and that connected interactivity throughout these difficult days uh, due to the pandemic. And if we, have, we get your photos, we may pick one uh, to be featured during the closing ceremony. So don't forget to use all these uh, uh, connection tools, these uh, social media tools, and uh, with the hashtag PCRVAVS. And if you are following us live on Twitter or Facebook, join us, uh, it's uh, free. So uh, having said that, I would like to thank you all, thank to all the colleagues who already connected with us. We wish you all an excellent uh, meeting. Uh, so it's time to kick off day one main arena of this PCRVAVS eCourse 2020.